Lake sturgeon are a prehistoric fish that live primarily in the Missouri and Mississippi rivers. They can live to be over 100 years and can get to be over 200 pounds. They don't have any teeth. They have this tube-shaped mouth, and so they eat crayfish and insects and small fish. They're very impressive. Lake sturgeon were always a part of our historical fauna. I mean, you go all the way back into the Lewis and Clark days, and they were catching them even back then. And, you know, they really disappeared in Missouri because of pollution or changes in the habitat in, in our big rivers. And so we're working hard to help restore some of that, to bring back some of the habitats they need. We've been able to identify over the course of the last several years a couple of sites where we know that they've been spawning. In both of the locations that we've had Lake Sturgeon confirmed spawning, those first reports came from volunteers throughout the state. People who were out fishing, who were seeing these things, and they said, hey, this is something pretty cool. When lake sturgeon go to spawn, there are a couple different things that you can see. You may see them cruising the surface, you may see them porpoising, but the thing that really stands out is you'll see these large fish thrashing around on the rocks, and that's the actual spawning that's going on. So if you see that activity, please call an MDC employee so we can get some folks out there. This is the first time that we've actually spawned lake sturgeon in our hatchery system for uh, releasing fish into the wild. We're a blind pony hatchery right now. So first we end up, we have some males that we were able to catch in the wild. We harvest the milk from them. Uh, we save that back. And then as those females become ready, we put them in this machine that we're able to hold them down on. And then we start to massage their belly to help force those eggs out and you know they can release thousands of eggs at one time, then we'll go ahead and put that milt in there and then uh, hold those fish within the hatchery system as they start to develop. They're being held here at My Pony Hatchery and then as they hatch out, we will transfer them to Lost Valley Hatchery. That's where we will grow them out through the rest of the year and they will be stocked in our waters in September. You know, for me, it, it's, a, it's a height of my career. We started stocking them and, and trying to recover the species when I was still in high school. So to be at that point, I've been with MDC for nearly 35 years, and to get us to that point where we're starting to see those fish or being coming adults and starting to do what fish do out there in the wild, and we're just helping them uh, be wild lake sturgeon out here in Missouri.